DVD if, if we ever want to watch it. What does Roger Ebert have to say about it, actually? He, I would assume he hated oh. it. Uh, this is a, a newer one, uh, Sonic the Hedgehog, released uh, this last year, February 14th, 2020. Uh, made $319 million from a $90 million budget, so it's profitable. Uh, reviews were mixed, but it was mostly positive. Uh, this was the highest grossing video game film of all time in the USA. Uh, we got some other movies that have made some more money, but we'll get into that later. Uh, so the picture here, this is what this comment's about. So uh, they released a trailer for Sonic, and the guy on the left was the original character design, but it was so awful looking. The fans were trolling it, saying how awful it looked, that the filmmakers, like this I feel like never happens. The filmmakers are like, all right, we're listening to the fans. We're delaying the movie. It was supposed to come out in November 2019, but they delayed it to February 2020 just so they can do the redesign, which I think looks a lot better. And oh, it was obviously profitable and I saw the movie I, it's like a fun movie it's like it's definitely more of like a kids movie but also very fun and it and uh, I think it's a cool vibe I wish I remembered this for the conspiracy theory episode this is my conspiracy theory okay <laughs> I think that that was fake the real design was like what we actually saw and then they did like a really crappy trailer to generate hype. Publicity, like publicity, basically. Yeah, like they knew people were going to hate it. They knew people were going to talk about it. People were mad. People were angry, and yeah. it worked. And well, good. If that's true, that's good on them. But uh, have you you've seen the movie, Derek? I saw it with you the first yeah, time. Yeah, of course. <laughs> like, did you did you like the movie? I mean, it was a little cheesy. It was a kids movie, so I mean, it's a kids movie. That's the only thing. <laughs> if, but it's like still fun and like it's like some nice heart moments. Like, yeah. Jim Carrey was pretty good in it. I thought he, like, he's like, you know, he's so physical. Man, he can do anything. You are one pathetic loser. Yeah, yeah. Dak or Derek? Or, I mean, Dak. <laughs> You've seen. Who the hell are you? <laughs> Have you seen the Sonic the Hedgehog? No, oh, man. I heard. I heard there was a lot of controversy. Um, I, I can't get involved in something like this. So very, very weird. Very weird. I, it doesn't look good to me at all. It doesn't look like something I would ever watch. Yeah. Trip, yeah. yeah, it's definitely a kids movie, which I know that's not your uh, your forte so as, as Derek would like to say I, I hate animation so. you I mean, look at Sonic he's a cartoon basically All no, right, let's move. it wasn't good it wasn't bad it was just somewhere in the middle it was that's the thing yeah. if I was like 10 years old I think it would have been like a cool like I would have enjoyed it more because I'm a kid but like as an adult it's like yeah it's fun there's some like okay stuff like but whatever but also I've, I've never played like a Sonic game I've only played Sonic in uh, Super Smash Bros so I don't know the character Ooh. that well but it was fun so this one I know is going to cause some controversy because I know Dakota played World of Warcraft. I, I think so did Derek. So Warcraft came out June 10th, 2016, made $439 million off a $160 million budget. This is the highest grossing video game of all time worldwide. So Sonic had the U.S. domestic box office, this one worldwide because it was hated by both fans and critics, but it was a huge hit in China making $100 million there, and America didn't even go close to $100 million. So wow. it, was, it was definitely... They do this with like Transformers movies too. It's like there's a lot of action. You don't need to know English, so that's why it's big. That's why a lot of movies do that. They like make shitty movies with action and like cool visuals, so that it can play big in international markets. It does horrible in U.S. markets, but does great in like China, Russia, those kind of places. Um, Dakota, your World of Warcraft guy, what did you think of this movie? Because I know you've seen. It. Yeah, I actually saw it in theaters with uh, Targex Acquired, which is pretty cool. Um, nice. Visually, it was it was exciting. It was fun, but you know when you played the games for a big portion of your life, you have these expectations of yeah. the, the grandeur of what it should be. And it, it did not live up to that. And I feel like the, the caliber of actors too, didn't, didn't really live up to the hype. So yeah, pretty disappointing, but I guess it's better than not having one in a way. It's still fun. I mean, it's a fun movie. Like, would you know. watch it again? No. <laughs> <laughs> Derek, yeah. have you seen Warcraft? I actually have not played it or seen this. Oh, I, see, I, I forgot if you were a World of Warcraft guy or not. I just heard it's very addicting. I try to stay away, you know, I don't want to. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, well, would you watch the movie? Would you check it out for fun maybe one day? Uh, I don't know. You'd have to really sell me on it, but I'm not would really you rather watch good things. Mortal Kombat? What, what, out, of, out of everything, because you haven't seen any of these movies except for Sonic, so out of the ones <laughs> you haven't seen. All right, Which I would watch would you... Mortal Kombat. That's actually been on my list for a while. I would watch that, then Mario then warcraft yeah and then because you already seen sonic dakota what about you what's your list so far of what the best ones are because i've that seen you would, of... out of what you would want to watch well i've seen two out of three of them so, so the I only one i haven't the... seen is sonic you haven't seen uh, super mario <laughs> oh you're right you're right I, it was so bad i forgot about it <laughs> it's like sonic super mario brothers 
Yeah, I'll I'll, I'll watch uh, Warcraft over and over before. Okay. Uh, so oh yeah, I forgot. I had I had Need for Speed in this too. So Need for Speed released March fourteenth, twenty fourteen, oh, made two hundred and three million off a sixty six million dollar budget. Mostly negative reviews. Kid Cudi's in it. Oscar winner Rami Malek is uh, is in it. Big deal, I guess. Thoughts? Did, did I heard you were the guy that talked about cars. Yeah. Did anyone see this movie? I haven't. I can guess the plot though. I did see. It. <laughs> I saw this in theaters with Donovan, mostly because we lo- we just finished watching Breaking Bad, so we're like Aaron Paul, Aaron Paul. And plus, we both love Kid Cudi, and he's in it for like ten minutes. So, Dakota, did you see this one? No, again, I did not know this was a thing. If you had showed me this like before, saying the video game part, I probably would have thought this is part of the Fast and Furious saga uh, with our with our boy Vin Diesel. Excuse me. Excuse me. Um, but uh, but no, I, I don't think I'll be watching this one either. Yeah, this one wasn't that good. Basically, like Aaron Paul is like a race car driver, and he races like the bad guy. And then, like, some kid accident, like, his kid brother, like, his kid friend dies while he's racing the other guy. And he gets, Aaron Paul gets blamed and goes to jail. Then he gets out of jail. And then now there's, like, this secret race that's taking place. And if you win, you'll get, like, a million dollars or something. So his goal is to, like, win the race and expose the bad guy and, like, prove that he's that he's the one who killed that kid or whatever. Not, a, <laughs> not that great of a movie. I wouldn't watch it. But Aaron Paul's awesome. Yeah, great, great cast. Movie. I mean, great cast. Yeah. Great Kid Cudi, what does he do? Is he's he like a... his. He's like his friend who like helps him. Oh, so it's not. <laughs> is it's more than a cameo? No, yeah, it's more than a cameo. He's oh, like that's a, cool. He's like the third, third or fourth lead. Um, Im, Im, Igmoon Poots, who's in Twenty Eight Weeks, like, oh, yeah. she's in it. She's like the love interest. I know you know who that is. I don't know if Derek does. She's she's a good actress. She's in it. Like. It's like a cool movie, like just for fun, but it's not like anything I'd watch again or like anything good. But also, Need for Speed is just a racing game, so you have to like try to like make something up just for a decent story. Um, yeah. yeah so one. put that as number three for me, and then um, move the other one down to four. What was it? Uh, Warcraft. I don't even. I yeah, don't Warcraft even down to four. All right, uh, big one here. Derek really wanted this one on the list. He kept saying <laughs> Prince of Persia, so I, I had to deliver. Uh, released May twenty eighth, twenty ten. Made three hundred thirty-six million off a of two hundred. Damn, that's so much money. Imagine spending two hundred million dollars on a movie. Jeez. Uh, re- received mixed reviews from critics, with them saying better than most video games, but they were upset about the screenplay, the whitewashing. I mean, they're in Persia and there's white people playing Persians. That's not nice. Uh, and departure from the source material was the highest-grossing uh, video game movie of all time until Warcraft came out. Uh, have you guys seen this one? I have seen this one. Yeah. Sadly. Oh, damn. <laughs> Pretty bad then, huh? And these are all really bad movies, man. Are you getting at something here? Are you getting... Uh, uh, no, Mortal point? Kombat's sick, bro. Come on. <laughs> no. Yeah, you're right. There's not like one that are like, wow, this is like just a good movie. They're all like, it's good for this, or it's good if it's if you like cheesy, or yeah, for sure. Um, this movie was like two hours long or something, wasn't it? Like, it's a pretty long movie, isn't it? Well, it's an epic, dude. Epic movie, man. <laughs> epic shit. <laughs> I've seen pieces of it because my sister loves Jake Gyllenhaal, so I've seen most Jake Gyllenhaal. <laughs> but I've only seen pieces of this, and yeah, it looked pretty dumb. What's better, yeah. this or Bubble Boy? Probably Bubble uh, Boy. Real quick, real quick. <laughs> oh, Sam yes. H224222 um, is going to unsubscribe if Mark doesn't comment in the next minute. What does it say? I'm, <laughs> I'm in the middle of the, of the PowerPoint. I can't leave the PowerPoint. I'll mess it up. Can you just tell me what hey, it says? 